Hey guys, it's Shantrianas, and today I'm going to be showing you how I got this hair color. Today I'm using the Jade color from Ion Color Brilliance. So I'm using the Jade from Ion Color Brilliance. It's a part of their new line of gemstone hair dye. So I'm really excited to show you guys how I got it. Um, I went from purple to this color Jade hair. So we're going to see how I did that. They're only about $5 a box, which is a really, really good deal. And the color pigmentation is amazing. I just, I like it a lot. So this is what I use. So to start off, I'm going to show you guys the different shades that Ion has for their gemstone line. There's Tanzanite, there's also Garnet, Sapphire, Rose Quartz, and Jade. So this is what that looks like. Their package is a little different from the older ones. I think these are a lot better. I kind of like how reflective it is. I think it looks really cool. If you already do hair for a living, you probably already know this, but in order to open the hair dye, all you have to do is take the cap off and then um, kind of put the hair dye on top of it. So there's a little point that goes into the hair dye that makes it a lot easier to open. Um, when I was younger, I would just use like scissors to open it, but this is just so much easier and it's, it's very helpful. I love this color already. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh. Okay, Ion. Okay, Ion Color Brilliance. Okay, Jade. Okay. Ooh, okay. I also wanted to mention that for this hair dye, you do not need to mix it with any bleach or developer. This is just straight up hair dye. You don't have to mix it with anything, which is why I love it a lot. There's no guessing to it. It's literally just take it out of the box, put it into your bowl, and then put it on your hair. So super easy, super simple, and affordable. I mean, who doesn't want that? And this is basically me just putting on the hair dye. It was really easy to do. I had about six boxes of hair dye and I honestly didn't even need that many. I only used about four or five of them and that was more than enough to cover my whole head. I like to apply hair color with my hands. So this is kind of just what I'm gonna be doing from now on. Unless I'm doing something like an ombre where it needs to be very precise, I don't think it really matters that I use my hands for this. I just feel like it's a lot easier for me so this is why I usually just kind of use my hands. And this is the final result. I feel so freaking cute. I love this hair color so much. And this is a close up texture shot if anyone um, wanted to see kind of what my texture is like. I still do have a curl pattern, so it's not all bleached to death yet. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.